back youtube today we're going to be doing something a little bit different you guys let me know if you guys uh, want to see any more but this is my verona cabinet humidor i got it from cheaphumidors.com you can see that uh, three shelves and eight single drawer uh, the bottom is where i'm going to be putting my uh, humidifier when i get in i bought a hydra lg commercial humidifier so when i get it i'm probably going to do an unboxing as well Let's see at the top here. I, I just got these. These are the Alec Bradley uh, Tempest Imperator in Maduro. 20 in a box. Move that out of the way. We have here my favorite uh, cigars. The Alec Bradley Prensado. I believe this is the, um, the Gordos here. And underneath that are the Prensados as well. But those are the Churchills which got number one cigar of the year. In 2011 by Cigar Aficionado. These are the Alec Bradley Black Market. I only have five left in there. It's supposed to look like a Black Market weapons crate. Here's a La Roma de Cuba box. I have a few La Roma de Cubas in there, but I also have put the 2012 Cigar of the Year, La Flor de la Antilas by my father. Uh, another great company. Love their cigars. We're going to move down uh, to the singles drawer now, and I'll show you what I have. So we have some Romeo by Romeo and Juliet and some Romeo and Juliet short Churchills. Uh, some more Alec Bradley uh, Tempest Maduro Imperators. Uh, some Rocky Patel Vintage 1990s and some Rocky Patel Old World Vintages. Uh, some Padrones and some La Aurora Torpedoes. Mm. On the other side, we have some Prensado Robustos and a uh, Corona Gorda, I believe this is. Yeah, a Prince Auto Corona Gorda. These are special over here. This company is out of business, the Winston Cigar Company. This is uh, with the green wrapper, the Claro wrapper. That Those two cigars are actually over 20 years old. Next drawer, we have some Carlos Toranos, uh, the Don 770, and some Foseca Series F. Here we have one of my favorites, Hoya de Monterey Epic Year Number no. 2 from Cuba. Uh, the Cubans, uh, I really like. They have a nice, fresh flavor. You can always tell a Cuban cigar. And these are one of my favorites as well. These are my father, uh, number ones by Don Pepin Garcia and Jamie Garcia. Down here we have my Cubans. We have some uh, Cohiba Espanditos here. Down there you have some Sigolo Number no. 6s and Cohiba Robustos. Another box of Cohiba Robustos back there. And we have some uh, Trinidad uh, Churchill cigars. Amazing cigars. Just amazing. Uh, overall, I bought this humidor for $5.99 from CheapHumidors.com. Shipping was about $2.50. Then I had some import fees as well to get it up here to Canada. I'll put all the links in the description. I really recommend going to CheapHumidors.com just for humidors as well as cigars and accessories. If you guys really like these videos, I continue doing them as well as cigar reviews. And as always, guys, keep on reading.